so i have called the centers of the circles a and b a being the smaller circle and b being the bigger circle so even here you start by bisecting a b Then draw the arc that joins A to B. After you do that, at the center B, you construct a circle which is equal to the difference between the two radii. In this case, we have 30 millimeters and 20 millimeters. So you're going to draw a circle at the center B whose radius is equal to the difference of the two radii and the two red eye in this case the one of the bigger circle is 30 and the one of the smaller circle is 20. so at center b you will draw a circle of radius 10 millimeters which is equal to 30 minus 20. i hope you have understood that The small new circle of radius 10 millimeters that you have just drawn will intersect the bisector that you drew in the first place at a point I'm going to call C. You then draw a line from B to go through the point C and this line that goes through C will touch the outer circle at a point I'm going to call D. Point D becomes our first point of tangency on that circle. To get the other point of tangency, you will have to draw a line from A that is parallel to the line BD. So you slide from BD to A and when you draw that line, it's going to give you the other point of tangency on the smaller circle. Next thing you do after that is simply join the points of tangency to finally give you a common external tangent between two equal circles.